So our studio has been invaded by an army of kittens this morning, and they've brought along their fearless leader, our veterinarian, Dr. Marty Becker. He's going to show us some of his favorite new pet products for your indoor cat. They're products that will keep your cat happy, active, and most importantly, well-behaved. And Marty, I know indoor cats live longer, but that do doesn't necessarily mean that they're happier. Right. Well, cats are born to run wild. But what happens is boredom causes behavioral problems, and you get health problems because of obesity and lack of activity, but it doesn't have to stay that way. So we can borrow on the pioneering work of zoos and what veterinary behaviorists call environmental enrichment. So what you do is you do little tricks to kind of turn your home or house into a into cat a, jungle. Yeah, I yeah. love it. And well, we'll start right with this one because it is really a jungle for your cats. It's pretty complex, the system. Well, what you want to do is you want to be able to take the outside in. Outside cats face a lot of risk. They don't live as long no. because they have other cats, dogs, cars, and plus other people don't want using your flower beds as, their, as yeah. a litter box, right? So other companies have done enclosures used for your house or your yard. Over here, the, the Tower of Meows by Caddy Stacks, <laughs> by, by, pardon me, by Cats on Deck works perfect. Small footprint, but a lot of vertical space. And here, the critter... Really quick on that, so the cats are able to go from box to box. Those aren't just cages. That's like, actually a like, system like, of play. Like little It's Lego like a blocks. McDonald's, yeah, like play right. center yeah. um, where that they can all run around. It okay. can fit it on the deck in the house. Now, the critter condo here, this is this perfect. This is the critter condo. Now, this actually, you could take it to Central Park, put it in the yard, take it <laughs> camping, but they get to feel the grass on their feet, the wind in their face, chase bugs, but very safe. Yeah, That's and Clark inside there is having a good old time, so I can attest that he is happy as a... He's having a good time. I was going to say time. clam, but as a cat. Yeah. Okay, uh, next door... No, over I'm here is cross. Caddy Stacks. This is inside. They're going to claw on this, they're going to climb in this, they're going to explore on this. Very inexpensive, made out of cardboard. These actually fit together like little Lego blocks as well. And over here, we have the Kitty Trapeze, which is nice. And old Debbie here has really enjoyed this today. This hangs in your house, so instead of climbing on the furniture, climbing on the, uh, on the blinds, put them in something, they sleep in this thing, machine washable. It's very chic and fabulous, but is it safe? Oh, very safe. Yeah, you hook it to the wall or hook it on the ceiling, so it can hold a lot of weight. It's really adorable. machine washable. And, and, and good for multi-cat owners. Oh, you settle down, Miss Debbie. Hey, Debbie. All right. Now, it's also important that we allow cats to scratch. I know that's a big annoyance yeah. for a lot of people because cats take their you know, sofa and turn it into their scratch post. Right. You have some solutions. Well, clawing is a natural behavior. And so you, they do it to mark territory, to sharpen their claws, to stretch, and to exercise. So they, and they enjoy it a lot. So what you want to do is get them to claw on the things you want them to claw on. So not the side of the couch, not the wood door in the frame. So you don't know what kind of surface they like. Like, do they like carpet? Do they like cardboard? Do they like rope? Do they like wood? So you find out what surface they like. Do they like a vertical surface or a horizontal surface? I love surface? the one that's shaped like a dog. Now so these, are, the dog. these are great. 100% recycled paper. The Imperial Cat scratching posts here. You can put a little catnip on it to kind of get them to use it more. And then the, the kitty cabin, the critter cabin here is great because of the scratching surface on the outside. Little toy here with catnip and then to sleep inside. So they claw. Multi purpose. That's sniff, great for yeah. a small space, especially. And then finally, it's really important that you give cats toys. They actually need them. It's not a, it's not a luxury. It's right. a necessity. What we're doing now, this is great because it's actually, you put toys inside of here. They drop down inside these little holes here. You can put their food in there. So actually, they're going to eat, uh, find their food. This is great too. This uh, frolic cat twitch here, you can program it to go on while you're uh, at work. So they're going to get activity, a non lethal uh, way to play. That's great. It's automatic. And finally, organic catnip. <laughs> so your cat can take a trip uh, with them, not wow. leaving the farm there. <laughs> but it's really good to get them to use other toys and things. All right. Thank you, Marty. Dr. Thank Becker, you. we love your tips. And if you want more information on these products, go to abcnews.com slash GMA. And while you're there, you can find out how to adopt little Victoria, Debbie, and the rest of these kitties.